Hey guys, what's up? So once again, mp4podcast.com. And here is a video tip for all you guys who are uploading videos to YouTube and other uh, websites such as Vimeo. Um, I, I found this um, 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 uh, problem on uh, uh, Captain 8-Bit's video, but I found it on the Naruka box. And the Naruka box is a streaming media uh, internet box. And, you know, you can stream Netflix, YouTube, uh, pretty much anything that you want to stream. Now the problem with the Naruka box is that um, it reads H H H two six four. It's not um, anything to do with flash files, so it's only going to read it the way it is. So um, it doesn't have like a smart brain. Now when I was viewing um, the last episode of the Game Chasers, I noticed something a little weird. Uh, the subtitles were starting to get cut off you know um you know maybe like around here they were kind of like really close or so there was some other subtitles i saw and maybe like right around the top of billy's head right where his hair is that was getting chopped off and right below his uh elbow a little bit and that's because uh some camcorders i know that my Sanyo exactly 1010 uh has this problem and um the problem with the uh, Sanyo Exacti 1010 is that even though it records in uh, 1920 by 1080 uh, or uh, 1280 by 720, it's not 16 by 9 ratio. Uh, just to give you an example, sometimes when you guys buy TV sets, um, you know some TV sets are actually 16 by 10, and they're not 16 by 9. So a lot of these cameras they record in a different ratio and um, I, I think the reason they did that because the mo the LCD screens on the uh, camcorders are you know 16 by 8 or whatever the number is so that's what they record in. The problem is is that you uh, get something like this. Now this is a uh, 720p picture it's 1280 um, by 720p. However, I didn't set the 16 by 9 flag in there, so as you can see, it has two black bars. So you're probably thinking this is a squished together picture. No, it's not. Let's take a let me just lower this. Um, actually, this is my own video, but it's just as you can see now that it's playing, you can tell that um, the uh, Adobe uh, Flash Player was able to say, "Oh, this is 1280 by." Uh, 720. This is supposed to be 16 by 9, so it automatically fixes it because it knows somebody stupid like myself <laughs> uploaded it because um, I didn't do what I was supposed to do in Sony Vegas. So let me show you what you're supposed to do in Sony Vegas. Uh, and this probably applies to all other video editors. Right over here um, at the end of the video clip, you're going to see this little um, white box. Uh, you want to click on that. And then you want to go click 16 by 9 widescreen TV aspect ratio. And there you go. That's the correct aspect ratio. Uh, there's other aspect ratios right here. And we don't um, tell the um, file, file where it's supposed to be. It's going to default to what it is on the camera. Uh, which now if that happens your videos will have a uh, problem playing back on uh, Naruka boxes or other media boxes such as Apple TV, BoxyBox and so on and so on. So make sure you pick 16 by 9 and you close it. Now I do want to say this, uh, other cameras don't have this problem. Uh, some of them um, what they do is they record in 16 by 9 but the LCD screen is maybe a little off for size. Uh, so they actually are recording in the correct aspect ratio. Let me give you an example of what a, something that's a little similar. Uh, the iPhone 4 records 720p, uh, 1280 by uh, 720p. And um, the screen on the iPhone 4 is actually 4 by 3. So it's going to make people look a little um, taller because it's going to stretch up. And uh, but you really don't even notice it because the screen is kind of small. Um, but um, when it when it records the file, it 
properly uh, flags it as 16 by 9. Now, if it didn't flag it as 16 by 9, even though the resolution is 1280 uh, by 720p, you would get a 4 by 3 uh, image. And again, you would have to go into Sony Vegas and you would have to say, hey, uh, make this 16 by 9 so it shows up correctly. So that's my video tip for today. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, please subscribe to the channel. Take care, guys. And also, remember, to, um, if you're not a subscriber of Captain 8-Bit and the Game Chasers, you really have to check these guys out. They're amazing. Um, think American Pickers, but they go out and um, they <laughs> buy video games. It's a lot of fun. And I highly recommend the last uh, episode, Episode 8. It's probably one of my favorite uh, episodes and I don't want to say why it's so special but the ending is uh, epic that's all I'm going to say so once again guys mp4podcast.com signing out you guys take care later guys bye